is 6 58 in the morning and i'm getting ready to go back to work good morning sis oh, this feels so weird today is march 28th it is 6 58 in the morning and i'm getting ready to go back to work Let me stop playing around. Okay, I hope you guys can hear me. I'm talking a little low because I baby sleep. So I gotta, you know, if you know, you know. This is such a really weird feeling. I'm about to go ahead and start with my skincare. As y'all know, just show y'all what I'm using. I'm not gonna talk about it, even though you, it's the same thing. Going in with my cleanser. I need to read up too. Today's day one of going back to work. I'll be honest. Yesterday, as I was preparing for work, I was starting to like, I don't know if it's just like something that traumatized me when I was pregnant. I don't know, but I remember when I was in the beginning stage, like first trimester of being pregnant, I really liked drinking matcha. And when I drank it, I started feeling very nauseous and the taste was so different. Like my taste buds in the beginning of my trimester was like, it was off. But I couldn't eat certain things anymore because I'd get super nauseous. But yeah, I couldn't eat certain things because I get nauseous and matcha was definitely one of them and I loved matcha. But the taste of it mm, was literally disgusting. And I was starting to have that same taste in my mouth as I was like thinking about going back to work and literally preparing, getting my work clothes ready, preparing my work bag. I was like literally starting to have that same taste in my mouth. I don't know why. I think just because, you know, the last time I was at work was the last time I was pregnant. Yeah, like just going back made me started thinking. And I think just, you know, like it was weird. Like I was kind of scared for a moment. Like, why am I, why is this happening? It was just freaking me out. But anyways, I'm all good to go now and we're here. And before we do anything else, you know your girl gotta give you scripture and an affirmation or word of the day. I already read my Bible this morning. I prayed and did all of that. So the word of the day or the scripture of the day in Bible, it says, even when the way goes through Death Valley, I'm not afraid when you walk at my side. Your trusty shepherd cross makes me feel secure. Psalms 23, four. And that's the msg version the affirmation of the day i feel like this prayer is going to speak to someone today so it says and this is god saying to you and god is saying to you tonight or today the pain will end the tears will stop the doors will open a season of miracles and blessings are on the horizon don't give up period now i'm about to go in with my serum y'all was doing my hair yesterday girl it was literally so stressful. <laughs> like I was trying to get it prepared and install it and my whole tub clogged. I was so mad. But I'm excited for you guys to see the finished product of what it looks like now. I hope that my lace is laid down. Low key, I'm, I'm just really wanting to just go back to braids because the wig is itching and it's making me hot. I put on my moisturizer. My keys, Alicia Keys. I'm about to derma roll my skin real quick. This has a very good, great benefits. It deep puffs your face, helps with wrinkles, and overall just makes your face look a lot more smoother and slimmer. So when you do it, you always want to go outward and up. And I try to keep this cold because it feels way better when it's cold. But I really want the ice warmer. That's what I'm gonna get next. Is the ice warmer. Okay, so I'm done with my skincare. Now I'm gonna move forward in with my makeup. Brushing up these eyebrows. I really need to learn how to wax my own eyebrows. Y'all, I did my toes last night and they came out pretty good. They came out pretty good. I did a French tip. They're really good. It's literally giving like I went and got them done nothing else long. My goal is to be done. I mean, to be honest, I have more than enough time. I'll have to be to work till like 9.30. So I wanna be on the road around like eight. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and do my eyebrows. What I use to do my eyebrows Eyebrows, I use the Wet n Wild Breakup Proof, but it's actually eyeliner. But I ran out of my brow pencil, which I normally use by Revlon. 
it is what it is and so far with my lashes they look really good but i'm gonna go ahead and do my brows first because my brows take forever to do with this process you really want to be focused so i'm gonna do my brows and i'll come right back Y'all, I just got notification that my Shein package is out for delivery today. That means tomorrow I can wear my new work clothes. I love Shein. I love their prices. I love the items that they be having. But my thing is that they take so long for you to get your clothes. Like, why? Is it because it's coming from a different country? I don't understand that. I gotta wait dang near a week or two just to receive my clothes. But if I order on Amazon, my clothes are here within the next day, the next couple of days. Like, but I'm excited to record my Shein clothing haul for you guys. So stay tuned. Okay, so my brows are done. They're, they're actually pretty decent today. I wanted to update you guys on my therapy session. So what sucks was the first therapy session that I was supposed to have was supposed to be with a whole different company and it was supposed to be with a guy but it ended up being canceled because he had like a family emergency and they didn't know when he was gonna be back i explained and expressed to them how i really wanted a woman to be my therapist that was just my need um i felt like a guy can't really relate to a woman when it comes to postpartum you know what i'm saying so and that's one of the things i really wanted help with you know being a new mom mom advice you know i mean can't give me that okay he can try but i don't i need someone who's actually been there done that you know what i'm saying so that didn't work and i'm actually you know kind of happy because my friend recommended me to her therapist so um i went ahead and reached out to her and asked her if she was taking on any more clients and booked a first session together which was yesterday and i was really nervous but she was awesome like we just clicked it was a perfect match and i really hope and continue with her like the whole insurance thing is set up it's i don't know i'm still trying to understand it but i have faith it's all gonna work out but um yeah like it was like from what we even talked about was uh, very helpful and we only had a little bit of time together to get some things situated and it was taking a moment it meant if you have not ever tried therapy girl highly recommend and i highly suggest finding someone where you guys like understand you guys are on the same page and we are definitely on the same page and that's important to me we gotta be on the same page and me i always thought therapy was like you know we think therapy like oh ain't nothing wrong with me like i don't want to hurt myself or you know like that's what i thought therapy was for like general like honestly speaking i literally thought therapy was for like if you like just been through the worst of the worst your life is literally falling apart or you know and if that is then you know like i said there i don't you know i don't think therapy is like a bad thing to do in general i just didn't think i qualified for it <laughs> so it's like i don't think i like i haven't went through you know like some crazy crazy stuff i mean i went through some crazy stuff but it wasn't to the point where i'm like i need therapy but no like therapy is literally how she explained it she was like listen i'm not here to run your life and tell you what to do she was like i'm here to give you suggestions like any suggestions like you have full control over these meetings over your life because i'm here to give you options and suggestions I'm never going to tell you this is what you need to do this is what you should do she always gives me the opportunity to you know like what do you think about this or what do you think about this or you know instead of well i think you should do this you know like okay but what if i don't want to do that yeah i'm super excited to continue my next session very much worth it i really hope that i do my makeup good today i'm really kind of going for just a really natural simple look nothing too crazy something very just simple so <laughs> i pray that look gets accomplished Today. but i appreciate you guys um who are all who had all commented on my um post that i posted on youtube <laughs> you guys are like i love the ones who really do engage with me you guys are awesome y'all it's gonna take me a whole 55 minutes to get to work so that means i need to really try to finish early so that i can get there on time Okay, so I'm done with my brows and, and concealing them. So
so I'm getting ready to put on the Maybelline foundation and I'm in the color 240 golden beige I think I'm going to stop by Starbucks to get me some matcha I didn't get any from um, Target but y'all uh, after today my goal is to not spend any money going out to eat any money on Starbucks literally after today that is my goal I want to completely be bringing my own food and drinks but today just today hold me accountable if y'all see me in my next video going to starbucks again before work be like ajne didn't you just say you weren't gonna go to Starbucks? i'm trying to help you girl stop going to Starbucks. we gotta hold each other accountable okay because your girl trying to save our coins we need to save our coins okay we need to be stacking and saving so i'm about to go ahead and take this off i'm scared because i can't get my foundation right on my forehead if i have this on okay It's not the end of the world and it's not terrible, but it's not being perfect. But we don't got time. I'ma just dabble a little, just a little on my forehead. Not even a lot, just a little. I mean it's not bad. Is it bad you guys? It's bad. Uh, it's bad. It's okay. Maybe they'll never know. Maybe they'll never know. Okay, okay. Next concealer underneath. Concealer underneath the eyes. And now we blend her out. Baby boys up. I hear them. Going in with my setting spray. It smells like perfume. It smells good. Y'all, I pray that I don't cry today, leaving my baby. I feel like I might cry. Pro Fusions Contour. I need to clean my makeup brushes, but I don't even remember the last time I cleaned them and that's nasty. <laughs> like, girl, clean your makeup brushes. Okay, normally I would like conceal or with the powder, you know, but I don't have any. I have some, but it's not a lot. Okay, I'm starting to sweat. <sighs> I think this is how I'm gonna leave it. Or, you know, apply my blush and then that's it. So I'm gonna start with sweat. <sighs> okay. Now I'm done. I'm going to the hair. Ooh, but the curls, the curls. Something's not right. Hold on, cause what? Am I tripping or am I tripping? Because what? Y'all, this used to be 30 inches. It's not giving 30 inches. I'll go in with my hot comb and lay the top down. <sighs> yeah, I'm over it. I'm overdoing my makeup. I'm overdoing my hair. This part is lifted up this part is lifted up like this is why i get braids now because i'm sick of it and like the curls are really pretty i washed it yesterday with um my new shampoo conditioner new shampoo and conditioner the coco magic and it got the curls looking good but this hair is normally way longer than this so i'm guessing she just fell out but i'm also irritated because my eyebrows look a mess I look like I need to leave it to the professionals. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I'm beating myself up too much. What do you guys think? Let me know. I mean, it don't look bad, but you guys are probably like, girl, you look fine. I'm going go in with this. That's what I use. We're going to see, child. We're going to see. Let me stop stressing out. Like, what, what is that? What is this? Someone tell me. I'm about to go ahead and change into my work clothes, so let's go ahead and change. Wearing this black shirt. I really like how it has like this little line right here that really like helps cinch in your stomach. It just really gives you a nice fitted hourglass look. I'm wearing these pants. 
right here. It looks really good together. I already tried it on. And then for my shoes, I'm gonna wear these together. The uh, lunch, cute. So that is it for getting ready with work, getting ready to go to work with me. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope it wasn't all over the place like I normally am. Um, but wish me luck, you guys. Pray for your girl that today she has a good day, even though everything didn't go as planned with her hair. But so I'll see you guys in the next one.